going on everybody it's your girl cherish Walteezy back with another one this month of april there are lots of fire kicks that are releasing so in today's video we will be talking about the top five sneakers that you need to cop in this month of april 2023 these are the most fire sneakers that i think are releasing this month but before we get into today's video if you're new to the channel do me a huge favor go ahead and hit that subscribe button for your girl join the sneaker gang give this video a big thumbs up and if you haven't already head over to instagram and follow your girl at waltz32 without further ado let's go ahead and get into today's video and check out these kicks so before we get started, I do got to let you guys know I will be saying the top five sneakers in order by their release date. So don't think I'm saying one shoe is better than the other. They are strictly just being released on this video by when they release. So we'll start from the releases that are closer to today and go through the month of April to go over the top five. So shoe number one is the Air Jordan 1 Lucky Green. These bad boys are releasing on April the 15th, which is next Saturday. These joints are releasing in a full family size run, guys. We have the retail for the men's sizes as 180 US dollars, grade school 150, and then we have preschool as 85, and then toddler will be 60 US dollars on these things, guys. I have also heard that these shoes are supposed to be releasing as exclusive access on on the sneakers app tomorrow which will be april the 6th guys so make sure you check that out it's supposed to go down at 11 a.m central standard time so make sure to check your sneakers out around that time see if you got access because you may be able to get these things early but if not April 15th is your day. Shoe number two is the Air Jordan 13 Black Flint. These will be releasing on April the 22nd, which is also a Saturday, and are also releasing in a full family size run. The men's sizes are going for 200 bones, y'all. And then we have grade school going for 150 US dollars, preschool going for 80, and toddler going for 60 US dollars. As you guys saw in my video when it talks about the Air Jordan 13 playoffs and got those joints early, it was my first ever pair of 13s, and your girl fell in love with them. So really looking forward to adding another pair of 13s to the collection they're just so comfortable y'all they're looking really fire in these pictures shoe number three has to be my favorite release of april 2023 it's the air jordan one washed pink guys these things are also releasing on saturday april the 22nd man these kids are going to be a problem i cannot wait to get my hands on a pair of these things y'all i hope it's just good quality that's all i'm concerned about but they look good they remind me a lot of the hyper royals but just in like a pink colorway so definitely looking forward to grabbing these things they will be releasing as a women's exclusive y'all we got the women's sizes retailing for 180 us dollars grade school for 85 us dollars and then toddler and infant is going to be going for 70 us dollars like i mentioned y'all these things about to be a problem. Shoe number four is another big release for April. It's the Travis Scott Air Jordan 1 Low Olives. These things are releasing on April the 26th and will be releasing in, I believe, a full family size run. So they are releasing as a women's exclusive with a retail price of 150 US dollars. These things are definitely going to be a big cop for just about everybody. I feel like they are going to be hard to get, even though that I've heard a lot of complaints about these Travis Scott 1 Lows. But I think this is like Travis Scott's last time collabing on a Jordan 1 I don't know that may also have some significance on these things and everyone may want to grab a pair so possibly I'm not gonna say possibly it's definitely gonna be a hard release to grab last but most definitely not least we have shoe number five which is the Air Jordan 3 Wizards PE these things are releasing on April the 29th in a full family size run with men's sizes retailing for $210 grade school going for 150 then we have preschool going for 90 and also toddler going for 70 I'm digging the colorway and who can just forget about the history that goes into the shoe I heard a lot of people say that they do look good in hand as well so I'm very curious to see my myself i'm a huge fan of jordan threes too so i don't really have a pair of jordan threes that i can complain about so i'm really looking forward to seeing how these wizards pe look definitely think it's going to be a cop for a lot of people so let me know if you guys are going for these things all right y'all i told you guys that april has some fire kicks coming out these are just the top five kicks that i think are worth the buy for this month of april let me know down below in the comments what you guys think which one of these things you're going for if you're going for all of them if you're going for none of them if there were some shoes that you think i missed that are in the top releases of april let me know down below in the comments 
I definitely want to hear what you guys think. Also, if you guys haven't done so already, I'd really appreciate it if you hit that subscribe button for your girl. Join the sneaker gang and make sure to go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to smash the notification bell so you're notified each and every time I drop a banger. Good luck on taking dubs this month, guys. I will catch you in the next one.